Mm, it's going to be fun. This is going to be fun. You're probably wondering where all the low down shots are coming from. That's because today's video is about macro photography. Okay, it looks like we're going to have to abandon the tripod. Right, because we've got a broken tripod, I'm going to be a bit limited on the type of shots I can get, so I'm only going to be able to shoot handheld at the moment. Um, I'm going to have a little route round in the ground and see what insects or in anything interesting that I can see that might lend itself well to some macro photography. Um, yeah, it's a bit of a shame, but there you go. That's how it goes sometimes. So, something a little bit interesting. We've got a couple of shoots coming out of a tree. So, might make an interesting subject. Might be a bit hard to film this and take the shot at the same time, it's quite high up. these things buried in the ground just buried in the ground so grab an image of that check up on screen see what it looks like so I think one of the rules in photography uh, applies to macro photography which is change your angle the angle which you see the world in is the way everybody sees the world. So when you take a photo from eye level, it just looks like normal to everybody. Whereas macro photography, because you're seeing something like you would not normally see it. And I think that's what makes it so interesting. But, you know, macro photography is not for everyone. Taking macro photography is not easy. It's very, you've got to be very patient takes a lot of time just to get a good image sometimes. I mean, you can take pictures of ina inanimate objects and get some really good images because they're inanimate and it's easy to pose them, but life, insects, insects and things like that can be quite tricky, getting the focus right. There's a lot of, uh, so there's a lot of things to consider, but if you enjoy just being out and taking photos, then why not give macro photography a go? Let's give this a go.
so there's a little tiny red thing um, not sure what it was called but I'll pop the images up on the screen Okay, so definitely not the uh, shot of the year, but uh, I'll take it. less naturistic things I've seen and probably one of the more common so it wasn't the most successful trip out in the woods to get some macro photography there is plenty to take photos of though don't get me wrong trees bark uh, acorns pine cones whatever the hell they are um, stones, gravel, twigs, fl loads of flowers. Well, not out here, but in the wild there is. Um, but for me, it was about getting out of my area and taking photos of something that I don't really see every day. Um, I didn't really achieve that today, but that's not a big deal. I've got a couple of nice shots, I think. Um, let me know what you think in the comments. And uh, if you did like this video, uh, please do consider giving me a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please do consider subscribing to the page. Uh, that's it for me. Catch you on the next one.